Hey Keto fam, Keto Kelly just getting her done. Today is Wednesday, May the 30th already. And oh, my stress has been through the roof for the last, well, since Friday. Um, I was taking, I'm, listen, I am so over macroeconomics, it's not even funny. Uh, took a couple tests this weekend and stress level was through the roof. Hubby and I were outside doing some serious yard work, clearing brush, I mean sweating. It was like 90 degrees Saturday and Sunday, and we were outside sweating. And whenever I do stuff like that and I sweat, I always gain weight for some reason. I don't know. My husband left, lost like five pounds over the weekend. I gained like two. Also, yesterday, I screwed up big time. I ate regular tacos yesterday. I was so stressed. I, I had about 50 grams of total carbohydrates yesterday. Yeah, it was bad. 26 grams of, um, I think, uh, net carbs. But I've gone back to, to uh, counting total. And I've given myself a 25 gram total barrier. Uh, I'm cooking up the rest of this pork. I have it in my skillet right now. Oh, so I was up to like 182.8 or 183. This morning I'm right at 183. So I got some making up to do. Alright, this is the rest of the pulled pork that I have. Over here I have a, a pan full of uh, chicken legs that I've baked uh, almost to done in the oven. And I'm going to grill them. I'm not sure if I'll eat that today, but we'll see. It's three ounces of the pickled jalapenos for one ounce. It's one gram of carbs, so that's three grams. I'm not going to eat this whole thing. I just need to cook the rest of this off. Uh, what I'm going to make is some taquitos. I'm going to make some taquitos, and I'm going to use the lavish bread. So I found this, the, the Joseph lavish bread and pita bread. And I'm going to tell you, this stuff is dangerous because it's, it's good. Um, if you have wheat allergen, don't use it because chances are you're not going to do well with it. Uh, it is 8 total grams of carbohydrates per sheet, uh, per half a sheet. So for one whole sheet, it's 16 total. It has 3 fibers, so if you do a net, that would be 10 for one full sheet and 5 for a half. So. I've cut it in half and I've cut it into little strips like this. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put the pork inside and I'm going to roll them. I'm going to toast these, to, I think, in a, in a frying pan first. I might toast these in a frying pan first before I do that. But here's the other half right here. I got four of these right here. Um, so that's what I'm going to eat for right now. I'm going to go ahead and mix this up. I'm going to use some of the Taco Bell seasoning to put inside. And that's what I'm going to eat right now. I don't know if if I'll end up, I don't know if I'm going to end up eating any of that chicken today. But I was going to do the chicken on the grill with some G. Hughes barbecue sauce and some roasted cauliflower. I will do that for my family, but I don't know if I'll end up eating it. It's almost 2 o'clock right now. Yeah, it's almost 2 o'clock. So I'm going to cook this. i got to take my daughter down to the recruiting office real quick, get some stuff done there. Uh, I've already filmed my uh, picnic collab for tomorrow. I just need to um, edit and upload that video for tomorrow. And uh, yeah, that salad that I made did not last long at all. So, alright, working on getting stuff down. Now, I don't know if this is going to affect me or not. I don't know. We'll see. So, yeah, that's what it's going to be today guys I'll probably come in a little bit later to add to this video to let you know whether or not I do the chicken so all right guys hang on and I might see you in a little bit hey guys I'm coming back forgive what's going on with the hair a little wild um it is now almost 3 15 I have a whole head of cauliflower in here and I like to keep the stems on them I, I don't mind the stems the florets are okay too I mean I like the stems. I have here six tablespoons of butter melted. I'm going to pour that over the top. Ooh, that was loud. 
put some pepper. I got my oven preheated to 350 degrees. Gonna add some salt. Little shake of garlic. And just a little shake of onion powder. I'm gonna roast this on 350. Probably about 30 minutes, guys. I don't mind mine a little al dente, but you can test it about halfway through. All coated. Put it right on my sheet tray. Spread it out. <laughs> the butter congealed because the cauliflower is cold. So I'm going to go ahead and roast this for 30 minutes. Hopefully it'll be done before 4 so I can eat it. Um, I went ahead and pre-baked my chicken, but when I was outside, I just came from outside from the grill, and I used some of the G. Hughes barbecue sauce. Look at that, guys. I love barbecue chicken on the grill. So delicious. Mmm. Yeah. So, with the lavish bread, it was decent. I mean, I got a, I still have a whole pot or pan of that pork. I used about an ounce of meat and probably a two teaspoons of the, of the uh, hot peppers. I mean, this thing is still, it's like full. So, maybe two and a half tablespoons of pork all together in those little pieces left. They were okay. I mean, you know, it's, I don't know if it's one of those deals where versus not having it at all, just don't substitute it for anything. But they were good. The pita breads are good. You got to be careful with those guys. So they do have a lot of ingredients in them. Got to be careful with them. Those are going to be a once in a while type thing for me. My hubby liked them. He's uh, I made him a BLT in one of the pitas the other day, and he really liked it. So, I mean, even if I could get him to stop eating some stuff, he may not be quite as strict as me. But just to get him to stop eating some stuff is a win for me. So, All right. So, that's going to do it today, guys. I'll come in on Friday, June the 1st, with my end-of-the-month weigh-in. Hopefully, I can shed at least two pounds between now and Friday. We'll see. I'm not really sweating it anyway. Um, eating those tacos, real tacos yesterday, I think just really, you know, you gotta be real. You gotta, you gotta let people know when you screw up. I'm not perfect, never claim to be. So uh, stress, school is stressing me a little bit right now. My daughter's graduation's coming up. My daughter from Arizona's coming in next week. My middle daughter may be coming with us to Maine. We're pulling the camper to Maine. There's a lot of stuff going on. So, okay. All right. So that's what I'm going to have, guys. I'm going to let this cauliflower cook for about 30 minutes. going to have my barbecue chicken, and that's what I'm going to do. And I'll go ahead and post my macros of that at the end of this video. And um, I'll see you guys tomorrow when I post my video for my picnic collab. Have a great day, guys, and I'll see you on Friday. Hey,